Good morning, reefing peoples. I was asked a uh, incredibly good question. Would I buy the ice cap K100, K1100 again? Well, I did. I bought a new one and then I bought a, a return one to Amazon called the Amazon Warehouse. I made a video of it. But the answer is, would I buy another one? Now, I have two answers to that, unfortunately. This is not a yes and no uh, answer. If you have a place in your sump, as in this situation, where the control knob is completely out of the way, so I can stick my hand in here, I can do things, and I know I'm not going to touch that knob because this skimmer has a very sensitive control knob. One little tick and you're out of whack. You'll come back later and it'll be overflowing. Now let's look at one. So in this case, yes, I would. If it's in a sump where you're not gonna bump that knob, definitely would buy another one. Now let's look at another case. Okay, here's case number two, where the only way I can get this to fit in this sump is for the uh, knob to be facing uh, forward. There's no room to turn it around the other way. So in this case, the knob is right here in your face. And if you're clumsy like I am, uh, you're gonna bump it. And if you bump it, you're going to see it go up or down depending upon how you, you move it. So let's just slightly tick it up. See the foam? It's going to overflow. This is what I mean. This is a really, really the sensitive dial. Uh, it's unfortunate. Because otherwise, I've had very good luck with ice cap products. I know uh, a lot of people have not. I've had very, very good luck with them. Uh, I keep them well maintained. I keep them clean. Uh, and I've had no trouble with them. This is the one thing I don't like about this particular model is that knob is just way too sensitive. So there you go, Mr. Diaz. I uh, hope that answered your question. I'll see you guys later.